Hey y'all, it's Kiondis. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I appreciate each and every one of you. If you're new, please consider subscribing and tap the bell to be notified every time I upload a video. In today's video, I'll be doing a quick Afro puff tutorial. It usually takes me less than five minutes. So if you're interested in seeing this quick process, just keep on watching. I'm going to start by misting my hair with warm water to add moisture and to make my hair more manageable. Then I'm using my hands to gently work that water into my tresses. Next, I'm going to gather my hair and position it where I want my puff to be. I'm going for a high puff, so I'm pushing the hair to the top of my head. And I'm using a satin scrunchie to loosely hold the ends of my hair in place. To more tightly secure my puff, I'll be taking a knee-high stocking wrapping it around the base of my puff and securing the ends of the stocking in the back. Now it's time to do a little something, something to my postpartum edges. Not too much, just a little bit. I'm gonna hit y'all with a little light work swoop action. Get ready to get into the slow-mo. And afterwards, I'm going to apply my scarf to set my edges in place. After laying my edges, the last step is to release those ends and fluff the puff. And I'm going to do this until my heart is content and the puff is shaped to my liking. After fluffing, I remove my scarf, do a little more pulling, patting, and shaping, and that's pretty much it. Quick, simple, and easy. So these are my results. I hope y'all enjoyed this quick Afro Puff tutorial and that it was helpful. Leave any questions you have below. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share this video with all your people. And until next time, I'll talk to y'all later.